How are you today? I think I'll speak to your son. The reason I'm running is for God and my country, but that's why I'm running for Congress. It's real simple. Are you tired of the Republicans song and dance? Are you tired of the Democrats and change? Are you tired of voting for the least of these people? Tired of party politics as they have the same progressive party? Tired of public, no public hearings that we the people can respond to? You might as well be talking to the wall, but the lights are on and nobody's home. Uh, tired of permanent employees in our government that don't go home as they need to live under the laws they create. They need to have term limits, which I support too, in all offices. Tired of where's the job? Or where's the money that Congress appropriated? Or the Republican Congress in 2006 that went crazy. Then I hear 2008 the Democrats spent even more. We need to make Congress accountable. Tired of I will fix housing when I get on the housing committee, and then later they switched to ways and means to get more money, and they did nothing for housing but allowed them to continue to drop in value. If you're as tired as I am, I am your alternative. I'm an independent American who believes in small government, states' rights, and the Constitution, and I want your vote in November. We need to take our country back. You can ask my progressive opponents why they continue spending like drunken sailors, or why, while you're watching in this hand, they're taking the money in this hand, or why they don't balance the budget, which I support while others opposed it previously in 2008, and now they say they support it. Or about illegal immigration, and why they won't secure the border using the current laws that are on the books, or why they won't get rid of sanctuary cities. Does this mean we're just going to have illegal amnesty again? Or let the illegals in our country again, like before, that still no closed borders? Now, the illegals don't only bring their suitcases, they bring their nightstands, their bedroom sets, and their drugs to sell. When is enough enough? Look at health care. If we remove the illegals from the system, prices will go down on our health care and it will become more affordable. Our system was the best in the world until you let the government get involved and keep government out of our health care. Congress has health care. They have private retirement. And you know they're exempt from Social Security and Medicare that we have? Why? Congress works for us, don't they? Are you tired of Congress that does nothing? will waste your money and they won't make the budget before the election and ask them why. They don't want you to vote against them. We must take our country back here and now. These are just a few of the things that we the people must know before voting candidates into our government so we don't get stuck on more progressives or the least of two evils in our government again. Remember, vote for best in November. Russell Best, the true constitutionalist and the most conservative running for District 2. And you can see me on my website, and I have information in the back. If you go to there later, and I'll be glad to share anything you like with me. Then it takes seven minutes, but I guarantee you, you won't be bored to death. Bye bye.